Well, the Florida Aquarium and Lowry Park Zoo are teaming up to save endangered African penguins. They've introduced two penguins, hoping the male and female make a love connection. Fox 13's Jen Epstein has a story from Lowry Park Zoo. When you think of famous couples, you probably think of Romeo and Juliet, maybe Lucy and Desi, but there's a new couple in town, and their names are Thumbelina and Rocky, and they're penguins, and they're living at the Lowry Park Zoo. Very cool story, and to tell us more about this special love connection is Mike Terrell with the Florida Aquarium. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. So uh, what's so special about the two of these penguins, and why are they being put together? So Rocky used to live at the, the Florida Aquarium, and zoos and aquariums around the nation work together to make sure that our animals are the best taken care of possible. Mm -hmm. um, and so there's a group that makes sure that, that uh, if there's animals that need to mate and have offspring, that their genetics are good. And so Rocky and Thumbelina were matched up. It's kind of like Match.com. <laughs> um, and so, so Rocky now lives over here, and uh, hopefully we'll see some baby penguins soon. So they're genetically compatible, but what about uh, once you put them together? They've been together for about three weeks now. Are you seeing signs of a possible interest in one another? Yeah, so genetics is just the, the start of the story. So, uh, so we start by putting them together in the same area and just to get to know you. Um, but ever since we've put them together, um, they've been shaking their tail feathers at each other and flapping their wings and preening each <laughs> other, and those are all really good signs that they're getting along. So the hope is that uh, they get together and have some adorable little penguin babies, um, not just for the cuteness of it. I mean, there's a, there's a bigger importance here, right? Yeah, so zoos and aquariums work together all the time, not only to make sure that the animals they have are well taken care of, but also to impact wild populations. So the Association of Zoos and Aquariums has a program called SAFE, Saving Animals from Extinction. And it's zoos and aquariums working together to make sure that the wild populations that are critically endangered have the best shot at survival. Wonderful. Thanks so much for the explanation. No Sounds like a lot of pressure, but I think Thumbelina and Rocky can handle it. Only time will tell, though. So we'll keep checking in with the aquarium and the Lowry Park Zoo. Reporting from the Lowry Park Zoo, Jen Epstein, Fox 13 News.